Hey guys, Ellie here. Today, it is Monday afternoon. We have just returned home from the vet with Finny Kitty. Um, I wanted to make a quick video updating you guys on what's going on, so he's home. He has a little bandage around his front right leg. That's where they had the catheter in, so that's the reason it's bandaged up. He's still kind of skeeved out, it's a bit sore. This doesn't mean that he had a leg injury, that's why he had the fever or anything like that. We're still waiting for the test to come back so we can find out what the cause of the fever was. And we may not even find out then because, I mean, even in humans, I know there's so many unknown and undiscovered diseases that people get. So I imagine it's probably the same way with cats. That's besides the point. The point is, is that Finny Kitty's home. He's doing a lot better. Um, our responsibilities are to make sure he's eating and drinking and that he's doing okay. And we will take him back to the vet soon to give an update to let them actually he has some shots that he needs to go get like a rabies shot a fiv shot and different things like that so he'll be going back to the vet soon but in the meantime we thank you guys so much for all the love and support all the prayers that you sent our way and we're just so thankful so grateful that he's back home and that he's doing well and that everything's good on a different note Little Loveland right here is really, really harassing him, giving him a hard time. I'm just gonna stay silent for a moment and let you guys watch. Literally, look, guys. I'm gonna stay silent, says literally, look, guys. <laughs> Everyone knows I can't stay silent no matter how hard I try. Picture if you were in Finny Kitty's shoes. You had a raging fever the past three, four, five days and you finally start feeling better, your first chance to come home and you just want to relax, and your little sibling, your little baby sibling, will not leave you alone. Literally harassing you <laughs> to no end. Oh my goodness. Little Loveland hasn't had her big brother to play with him for days, so that's why she's so excited. She's really come out of her shell, actually since Finnegan hasn't been here, probably because now she's the big cat of the house. And so she just feels like the king of the hill, feels like she's on top of the world. Like, I thought she was crazy before, but since she's had the house to herself, she literally, how did you put it? How did you explain it? You said that- She's wild. No, you said like she thinks she's the stuff oh, or something. Yeah, she thinks she's the crap. She thinks she's the crap. Like she thinks that she, she thinks she's hot stuff now. Yeah, awesome. yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know who she thinks she is. Like, why she thinks because she's oh, this big girl. Because Finny Kitty hasn't been here to humble her, so she's... I'll tell you what, though, in the car when Finn got angry at her, she who did she jump to? She definitely cowered down then. <laughs> but no, she wants nothing to do with us now. Like, as soon as we... He came back in here, we're chopped liver. <laughs> chopped liver. Really? Alright, I'm gonna get from this angle. This angle's gonna be funny right here. Let's see if I can capture some. Aw, oh, Finny Kitty. Finnegan. You feeling better, buddy? I think you can see in his eyes even that he has quite a bit more life in them if he'll turn this way. Finnegan. Hey, cat. There we go. Yeah, look how lively those eyes are. Those are big old typical Finny Kitty eyes, not the sunken, drained ones that we saw a few days ago. Hey, that, oh my goodness. Now that right there is where I'm gonna draw the line when I start getting bit. Dang girl, what's wrong with you? My poor feet, uh-oh. Yeah, suddenly when Finnegan stands up, she realizes how tall she is and she don't want to mess with him nearly as much anymore. Oh, she just stole this tunnel. As soon as he walks out, she went in there and stole it. <laughs> he's not happy, as you can tell. I don't think he's angry, though. I think he's just kind of like, are you kidding? And, and, and there she goes to her bed. I call that her bed because she sleeps there more than she likes to sleep anywhere else on top of the Xbox. All right, guys. Well, just a quick update. Feeny Kitty's home, doing better. 
and we will continue letting y'all know what's all going on. But with that said, I hope y'all enjoyed. Y'all be sure to let me know in the comments what kind of stuff you'd like to see. We hope you all have an incredibly blessed day. And as I always say, your boy Elliot.